An index match and a VLOOKUP can both be used to augment your tables with descriptive lookup information. Throughout my career, I've found an index match to be more reliable and flexible than a VLOOKUP. And in this video, I'll explain why. So if you watched our VLOOKUP video, we walked through an example of pulling in descriptive information for a subsection of your employees. So if I use a VLOOKUP, I can easily query the lookup value locked in its column, the table array locked in place, the column index number, and then make sure it's an exact match. That lets me fill that down. What I could do is I could drag this over to its right and I'd need to go through and update the different column numbers to make sure I'm pulling in the right column. And that is one way to update this is to use a VLOOKUP. I'm gonna show you a different way, which is personally my preference, which is to use an index match. The advantage for this is instead of having to update these column numbers, what you can do is simply write the right combination of absolute and relative references. So if I put an index, my array will be what I want to return. So what I'll do is I'll fill in the employee name and I'll lock that in its rows, but leave the columns flexible. And then I want to match on my employee number, which I'll lock in its column, leave the row flexible. And then my lookup array will be the employee number locked in its columns and its rows. My match type will be an exact match. I will close that and then I can just fill that in for my full table. And you see how quick that was? I didn't need to change the column numbers. I didn't need to update anything. Because I've written this with the right combination of absolute and relative references, I'm able to replicate this formula very, very quickly. First advantage of an index match makes it a lot easier because you don't need to deal with the column number. You just need to specify the column you want to return in your index. The first part, the array in the index formula. Second advantage of an index match is if you have a lookup table where the lookup value is not in the first column, it will not work for a VLOOKUP. So the way a VLOOKUP formula works is it always looks for a value in the leftmost column of a table. So if your data is structured where the lookup value is maybe in the middle or on the right, what it would force you to do is rebuild this table and potentially cut this and paste it over here, which is typically not best practice to manipulate your data set and you prefer to leave it as consistent as possible. But what you could do is use an index match and you could say index on what you want. So the employee name, lock that in its rows and then your match will help you find your row number. The lookup value is your employee number locked in column B, flexible in its rows. Your lookup array will be your employee number locked in place, exact match. And then I can copy this, paste it in my first few cells. And then if I just change this from column J to column K, now I've just replicated this whole table really, really quickly without having to change anything in my source data, which is always preferred in case you get an updated roster or updated piece of information. So you don't need to refresh moving this employee number to the left, refixing it. And a solution that I find to be much, much faster and much more flexible for any situation you need in Excel is an index match over a VLOOKUP. <laughs>